New at 10, businesses around the now site of the Weaver fertilizer plant fire are still trying to get financial help two weeks after that fire. City of Winston-Salem says it's trying to financially help people who live within a mile of the evacuation zone. A lot of business owners are asking, what about us? WXI's Justin Schreer spoke with one local business. And Justin, how were they affected and what are the chances that they're going to get some help as well? Yeah, Hedy, Kenny and Christine, good evening to both of you. Yeah, the manager here at Triad Seafood Market tells me that after the fire, they had to shut down for more than a week and throw out thousands of dollars worth of fish. And tonight, they're asking for some help. At Triad Seafood Market, the fish is back on ice. After having to shut down the night of the Winston Weaver fertilizer plant fire back on January 31st. They reopened about a week later on a Tuesday. Not only did we have to close, but you know, the employees, the employees had to be home. So of course, you know, they wasn't able to, you know, get paid and stuff like that, that whole week. Manager Shanika Bogan says because of the nearby fire, the smoke, and because of the fact that the employees couldn't work in the store to keep that product fresh, they had to throw out thousands of dollars worth of fish which is why Bogan is looking for some financial help for the small business she manages. With us being closed for over a week, yeah, that's a lot of product. You can, you can no longer sell that to the public. So, I mean, you just, you, you take a loss. Next week, the Winston-Salem City Council is expected to try and get financial help for people who were impacted by using money from the city's general fund. During the Finance Committee meeting Monday night, City Attorney Angela Carmen said businesses would not be eligible for that money. Mayor Pro Tem Dee Dee Adams says she and others, though, are trying to figure out another way to help them. I believe in my heart because I believe in the humanity of the citizens of Winston-Salem and how we care and how strong we are, that uh, we're going to find a way to help my small businesses. Even the mayor and Councilmember McIntosh said last night that their focus was the small business, even Councilmember Larson. So I'm sure we'll figure out a way. To In the meantime, Bogan hopes that financial help will come soon. It's a lot of companies around here and businesses that had to close due to the fire. And that city council meeting is expected to take place next Monday. Live here in Winston-Salem tonight, Justin Schreer, WXII 12 News. Kenny, Christine, to you. Justin, thanks.